So to begin this process, we're going to open just a generic male figure that I created for my creature design, or for, excuse me, for my human anatomy book. And this serves as a really nice base to work on to create the orc character. If I open up the other models here, you can see how I have just gone in, used the same body proportions, just pushed them a bit further into a more monstrous territory, and then obviously sculpted a demonic head onto the generic human. And here we have the posed version we can switch between. So this file is actually available for you with this, the data files that go along with this tutorial. I'm just loading this up and using it as my default mesh. Uh, I also have a set of teeth that I like to use. And in the next section, I'll show you how I organize those teeth so they can actually be manipulated independently uh, and sculpted more easily. So let's go ahead and take a look at that now.